Yo, what's going on guys? Your boy Invicted back again with another Dokkan Battle video. Right now, it's literally just gone live over on the Dokkan Battle Twitter. We're on the actual official Twitter page because you can see that blue tick and everything. They've officially announced a, a, a year late. A year late. Like, this, this unit's been out for a year. Literally, guys, a year. But they've an, actually announced it with no changes over onto the global side of the game let's check out what they put on their actual twitter itself and then they got uh, a little preview of the super attack animations and everything so the most powerful lr in the entire game the most broken unit this it needs a nerf like they should have just nerfed it on both sides of their games i don't understand why they brought it out like this the best lr in the game should be something that's memorable something like lr super saiyan 2 gohan or lr margin Vegeta or LR Super Saiyan 3 Goku. It should be one of those. It shouldn't be this random out of nowhere turn up a power sort of fight that just happened. It should be something amazing like a LR Vegito or a LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta or LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku and the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Those should be the best, right? Not this, but you know, people love the actual female Saiyans and I'm I'm a fan myself. I'm a fan myself. So let's go ahead and check out the actual unit itself. So two makes, what is that? Two makes the strongest of all universes. That makes no sense. What is this translation? Two makes the strongest of all universes. Two makes what? These two aren't the strongest out of the tournament of power. It was Goku and Jiren. Trying to say that these two, oh, this is, the translation is a joke or maybe it's it's the way that Japanese people kind of hype out certain things it, it makes it like it's meant to be this glorified thing but anyways um, LR, Kale and Khalifla they're here Super Saiyan 2, Khalifla and Super Saiyan 2, Kale obviously if you guys didn't know you can actually use the SSR, the TUR and the LR on the same team and if you're one of those crazy guys that you managed to pull that many copies of this unit, you can actually make a really broken team just with the TUR and the LR. So you can do that. So they haven't changed anything here. Join, uh, she, uh, she's a leader for, or these ladies, they're the leaders for Join Forces and Super AGL types. So let's check out uh, the next page. So yeah, these are the actual... Um, these are the actual, uh, wait, these are the base stats what they're showing here. This is not rainbow level. These are base stats without any hidden potential, right? So th these are the base stats that they're showing. Next up on the next page, they're showing all the links and the main uh, actual leader skill itself. So join forces category key, category key plus four, HP attack and defense plus 130%, or super AGL type key plus four, HP attack and defense plus 100%. Really, really good leader skill. Uh, join forces is a really, really powerful team as well. Whole bunch of LRs in there. It's basically join forces are any units where there's more than one character helping the other character out so just a really good team itself and they have not changed any of their passives any of their skills or anything so if anything um they have yeah they're, they're just as good as they were when they first came out so on the actual passive skill let's go ahead and check this out attack and defense plus 66 percent launches an additional attack key plus one up to six key and a chance of an evading enemy's attack including a super attack up six percent with each attack received up to a maximum of 66 percent so they have 66 percent chance to dodge and they have key that goes up to six when this unit first came out on the jp side of the game it completely broke the game it kept doing its 18 key super as an additional attack because this unit was getting such ridiculous amounts of key so they made that they made a fix even if you're past 18 key and you launch an additional super it will be your 12 key super not the 18 key super because it was previously launching the 18 key super which would basically just obliterate like completely annihilate any event in the game so they had to change that there's um, also uh, attack plus 10 percent per universe six join forces and pure saiyans category ally on the team if you have category allies that fit all three of those categories that's a 30 percent increase to the attack on this unit so this unit can get an attack 
stat, uh, it can get attack increase of 140%. That's just mad ridiculous. So in total, it, it can this unit can be at 200% attack, and it's an LR. Excuse me, Dokkan, nerf this unit. This should not be the best unit in the game. Nerf it. Like this needs a nerf. This needs a nerf on both sides of the game. You've been letting this character, LR Kale and Kleefler, abuse both sides of the game. Like, what, what's the reason of bringing this stupid, uh, stupendous, not stupid, stupendous, just amazing character to the game? And you made LR Gohan, the AGL one, just trash. You made LR Cell super trash. Why are you making top quality Dokkan Festival LRs trash and you're making this random LR the best LR in the game Like they've done it a year ago, so I know they ain't gonna change it now So if you guys are summoning for this LR and you managed to pull it just to let you know You've pulled the best unit in the game like literally you don't need any other characters in the game yet Don't spend any more money if you manage to rainbow this character. That's it. You're done with Dokkan. You finished the game I'm telling you that much you finished the game a anything in the game. Yeah is beatable by this LR it's ridiculous so yeah so the actually um links are amazing super same battlefield diva whereas universe six tournament power prepared for battle face battle and legendary power so we got the three main links there super Saiyan, prepared about prepared for battle and face battle they're there so amazing links she belongs to or well, these ladies belong to six different categories full power is just going to be absolutely broken on full power. Peppy girls, that's all right. Uh, Pure Saiyan is going to be absolutely broken there. Universe 6, they need it. Uh, Universal Survival Saga is going to be really good there. And Join Forces. So there's a bunch of LRs on the Join Forces. Here's another one. Okay, and um, this is the 12 key and 18 key. So 12 key raises defense, 18 key raises defense as well. So that's the standard stuff. And yeah, that's pretty much the LR, and then uh, they have a small little video. Ugh. We're gonna have it muted, so, you know. Let me put down a large uh, full screen, let's check this out. So this is the 12 key super. Okay, it's a bit slow, it's a bit slow. Let's see it like this. Nah, it's a bit slow, there's too many people watching it right now. But if you guys have already seen the super attacks, yeah, media cannot be played, let's try again. So here we've got the 12 key super, the regular just combination of um, fists flying at Goku. I mean, they didn't even manage to be like if they were gonna make the best LR in the game, make it Kefla. You know what I mean? Kefla is cool, but you got Kale and Khalifa. Like, they couldn't even beat Super Saiyan God Goku. Let alone they 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 were having trouble trying to. They couldn't even get to Super Saiyan three. What was this Super Saiyan two? They were both at. But yeah, nah, that's a pretty cool. So that's their 12 key, and here's their 18 key. Nah, that's their 12 key again. Why isn't it showing the 18 key? Let's see the 18. Yeah, here's the 18 key. Limit break blaster, yeah, that's the one. Yeah, that's the 18 key right there. There you go. Bam. So yeah, the uh, LR is officially announced in the game by uh, Dokkan Global. But you know what? This is the main, the main thing they should be announcing right now is their first place rewards. Like it's, we knew this LR was gonna come to the game. And I think at this point, most go global players don't care anymore. I have not. I've been. I've, I've seen through videos. I've seen through comment sections, I've seen through big video comment sections. A lot of the player base on the global side of the game just don't care anymore. We want LR Kefla or we want a global exclusive LR to come first. You know what I mean? We need something big in the game. And this LR Kale and Khalifa, even though we know they're the most broken unit in the game, it's not exciting because a certain someone in the community has been licking out this LR's backside for such a long time that it's just made it undesirable for anyone else to enjoy the game. <laughs> Yo, the truth, listen, you've ruined this LR. 
the truth dt yeah if you ever come across this video you're the reason why people don't are not gonna enjoy this a lot because you've been literally you've been up it's never regions for it so, for a while now so I, I don't understand like there's a lot of people that are just gonna be like all right cool but we expected this months ago this should have come out a long time ago but it's out now so you know major hype though major hype i'm i'm really excited to see what sort of banner it's on if it if if for some reason it's on a regular lr banner oh gosh uh can i can just expect all the hate like all the all the global shark and people are already spamming it on on the twitter on the i don't even bother to read the subreddits or anything because people are so toxic but uh, yeah, I see in people's videos exactly what's going on that Yeah, people are gonna be pretty wild up if Somehow this LR has come out and it's just some regular shafted LR banner. It has to be a double rates banner If it's not a double rates banner for global then That's just a violation. But yeah, anyways guys LR Kale and Khalifla they finally announced on global Dokkan battle so Save your stones guys, it's time to pull for the best LR in the entire game. I'll catch you guys on the next Dokkan Battle video. Peace out.